Today we're talking about the five steps to distribute your independent film on VOD platforms. All right, here we go. Number one, you want to create a plan. I've talked many times about the windows, right, where you have maybe a theatrical window if you're lucky, and then you're going to go to your tr transactional VOD, which is where they're going to pay to watch, the subscription-based VOD, which is where they have a subscription, Netflix or something like that, and they can watch uh, that program after, you know, just by uh, for free because they, they have a subscription, uh, or ad-based, where they can watch it for free, but they have to watch ads and going down those lines of windows. So look, if your plan going in is like, I'm gonna get on Netflix, okay, it's tough, all right? So try to look and say, what are, there's a lot of options out there. What, what platform seems to work well with my type of film? Number two, you wanna find a sales agent or distributor. And I've said this many, many times, you're gonna go to markets. You're gonna go to European film market in Berlin in, in February, Cannes Marché de Film in May, or the American film market in Santa Monica in, um, in November. So you're going to go to one of those three markets and then you're going to find a sales agent and distributor, pitch them on your movie, and they will be able to get it to VOD platforms. Number three, you want to brainstorm marketing materials, right? You want to know, all right, what are the best ways to promote this film? Get it out there. What are the things that people are going to see and they're going to go, oh, I want to see that movie. What is it? What is it? Is it a cool postcard? Is it a great poster? Is it an awesome trailer that you got from a trailer editor? Brainstorm those materials. It really helps you get a leg up. You're going to want to deliver your movie, right? When you get a sales agent and distributor, you have to deliver it. And delivery as a, <laughs> there's a whole thing on this. Uh, I mean, they're, they're, I could go on forever and what the delivery is, but most likely it's going to be a ProRes 422 or a ProRes 422 HQ version of the movie. And that's the highest, you know, uh, resolution that you're going to have unless somehow you did a 4K version and you're selling it to a 4K platform. That's interesting because a lot of these VOD platforms, they, they're not looking for the 4K version, they're just looking for the 2K version. And so that in that case, it'd be a ProRes 444 and deliver the movie. And whether that is putting it on a hard drive and sending it or whether uploading it. Now, some of those files get gigantic. A ProRes 444, I would not recommend uploading. Um, and so uh, bottom line is when you can get that movie, you get that, that's a whole thing, right? There's a whole list of delivery elements you got to do. And it's a big step in getting your movie to those VOD platforms. Number five, then you want to promote the movie. You don't want to just put it up there and just go, oh, I hope people see it. You want to go and follow up and get all the actors and the cast and crew to be tweeting about it, posting about it, you know, Instagramming about it, anything you can do to get people uh, talking and get them to click on links and watch your movie. Hey, thanks for watching. Just want to add, if you could like or comment below, that would be fantastic. You can also subscribe to the YouTube channel. If you ask a question, I will try to answer it as quickly as possible. But I hope you enjoyed these videos.